Hi everyone, this is teacher Sandra. And in this video, I'll be going through the concept units times value. Let's look at the question. John has $91, which consists of $5 and $2 notes. If he has four times as many $2 notes as $5 notes, how many notes does he have all together? Now, if you see here, it says that he has four times as many $2 notes as $5 notes. So this tells us the units. They also talk about the $5 notes and $2 notes, and that's the value of the notes. And they also give us the $91, which is the total value. Okay, let's narrow down to the four times again. What does this mean when they say that he has four times as many $2 notes as $5 notes? Four times as many $2 means this. There are four $2 notes and one $5 note in a set. So for every four $2 notes, there will be one $5 notes. So let's go and find the value of one set. Four $2 notes plus one $5 note. In total, that's $13. So the set, the value of one set is $13. So then there'll be many sets. It's not just one set. He does not only have four $2 notes and one $5 notes. He will have multiple sets of this, such that everything adds up to $91. So meaning he'll have 13, 13, 13, 13, and everything just adds up to $91. So the next thing we need to find out is how many sets are there? So if everything is $91 and one set is $13, we will have to divide to find the number of sets. So we take $91 divided by $13 and we find out that there are seven sets. So this happened seven times. There are seven sets of this. So what does the question want us to find? How many notes does he have all together? Now, so let's go back to one set. Five notes in one set. Therefore, the total number of notes will be 5 notes in one set times 7 sets. That will be a total of 35 notes. So the answer is John has 35 notes altogether. That's all for this question. I'll see you in the next video.